Hello and welcome to another update video about Crow Chronos Crypto.com coin. Um, I will, it will be a, f a quick one because there had, you know, we haven't really had a major update since the last video. All we're doing at the moment is consolidating still on a pretty high level. However, we might be, we're making slightly um, lower lows here and slightly lower highs. At the moment, my reading of this would be that the B wave top was in here and that we are ready to come down in a C wave. However, situation is fairly uncertain here. I wouldn't rule out also a breakout to the upside from here. However, we are in our zone. We are in our resistance zone here for um, Crow or Kronos, and we're waiting for the market to react. It already exited to the downside a few times, um, but without really a break below the wave one low here now at 7.6 cents, I cannot confirm to you that um, we are actually heading down in a third wave of the C wave of the second wave. Yeah? If we now move higher and um, should there be another bullish push here and we break above 8.3 cents, I think we have a chance that we have an extension here um, of this count and that we have a count like wave one, wave two, wave three, wave four, and that this is actually preparing us for a wave five move to the upside, that the wave five wasn't in here, but that we will get one more wave up. But um, situation is not entirely clear. Therefore, at the moment, my expectation would be that we are currently, um, that we currently completed already the B wave, or we are currently in the process of completing it. Now, this count is not to be understood that it will definitely work out. This is an idea how it could work out and how it will work out if we break below the wave one low. But for now, we are still in a consolidation here. And this could still be the B wave, <clears throat> you know, in some kind of a maybe a triangle or um, just more extended correction. This could be various stuff until we really break out and react really in a bearish way to this resistance. But um, yeah, at the moment, fairly uncertain. So I'm going to observe that for you. If we really come down from here and lose that wave one low, then we should get into this region between the 50% FIB level at six point, well, basically seven cents and the 78.6 FIB level at 6.14 cents. From here, we could then move up in a third wave. Um, again, what I cannot rule out at this stage is that there will be one more high. But either way, if there is one more high, then um, the next trade setup will come a bit later. I will have to move up the wave two support box higher, but then we just need to be a bit more patient for another entry point here in the wave two support area. That's all I can tell you today about Crow. Hopefully you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye bye.